any spread that is nine and a half or greater, you always bet the under. And here's the two reasons why. I think it's like 60% of these games have been hitting the under over a long period of time. The reason is because when there's that big of a spread, right, that large of a spread, the team that is favored is either going to blow the doors off this bad team and then take the foot off the gas at the end, or the the worst team is going to play unbelievable defense just like the Jets did yesterday, and they're going to make this a tight game. Yesterday, the Jets over and under was, what, 43 and a half against the Bills? 44 and a half? And they just played unbelievable defense where it was never a doubt that that game was going to be under. And then all of a sudden you have the, um, the Chiefs game last night. It's a, t- a 13 point favorite. What happens? Amazing defense by the Titans. This game goes into overtime 17 17. That's an automatic under. Both unders, since I found this that came across my desk, they both hit. I'm 2 0. I'm telling you right now, when there's a sp- 